Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. Today I would like to show you Cock Video X and how to easily get this up and running using Comfy UI. The videos currently playing were all created using the Cock Video X framework. Cock Video allows for the creation of short AI generated video clips from either text prompts or supplying the system with images. After following all the steps in this video, you'll end up on this screen, and this will give you an easy to use functional workflow in Comfy UI that's ready to execute and generate your first AI video clip. As mentioned, to deploy Cock Video X, you need a working Comfy UI and the Comfy UI Manager installed on your machine. Should you not have a working Comfy UI, Please first follow all the steps in this video on our channel and get your Comfy UI up and running. Let's get Cock Video X up and running in Comfy UI. The Cock Video X wrapper we are using allows us to easily get Cock Video working inside of Comfy UI. And this gives us the added benefit of switching quickly between AI image and AI video creation. The Cog X video wrapper is brought to us by Kajai. You can visit the official Project Gear page here, should you wish to read up and familiarize yourself with this project. And if you want to deep dive into the technology that's being used at the back of all this, you can visit the Cog Video and Cog Video X official Project Gear page using this link. Now let's build Cock video into Comfy UI. Open Comfy UI and then open your Comfy UI manager. In this manager screen, select the custom nodes option. With the custom node manager open, you can now just type Cock V into this search box and then you will see this Comfy UI Cock Video X wrapper from Kajai. Simply hit the install button. When the installation completes, it will ask you to restart Comfy. I am running Comfy in Anaconda, so I can follow the changes and track along here in my Anaconda prompt. Now we have the Cock Video X framework installed, but we'll also need a workflow to be able to initiate our first text to video creation. Visit the Cock X video wrapper GitHub page. Click here on this examples folder. Then click here on this Cock X5B example. Click this button to download this JSON file to your PC. Get back into Comfy. Find where you save this 5B example workflow. Select this file and simply drag this into the Comfy workspace. Don't stress about the red indicating some missing nodes. You can for now close this warning. Click on your Comfy Manager again. Simply click on Install Missing Custom Nodes and here it will show us the missing node. Click on Install to install the Comfy UI Video Helper Suite. With this now installed, you'll get an alert to restart the Comfy server. Restart and again you can follow along what's happening here in your prompt. At this stage, we have everything installed, except any of the models we need for video generation. If you were to go ahead and just submit your first prompt, and try and create the first video using the default prompt, you will get this alert on the first step of this process. It's complaining, we specified the Google T5 FP8 model here, but we haven't downloaded or installed this yet. Copy this model's name, and to rectify this, open your Comfy UI Manager, click on Model Manager, paste in the model name, or search for this Google T5 FP8 model. It's currently sitting at ID79. Install this model. Follow along in your prompt, and when the download completes, we just want to restart Comfy again. You still need the Cock Video X models at this stage. There are two models you can choose from. You can either opt for the 2 billion or 5 billion parameter model, or both. Here is a link to the Hugging Face space, 
where you can direct download these models, or if you want to study these model cards in a bit more detail. You don't need to download these models manually. The system will download them for you when you execute your first prompt. I would highly suggest you first get the 2 billion parameter model working properly on your system. Ensure that you've got enough resources for this and then move along to the 5 billion parameter model. Let's create our first video using the 2B model. In the model node, select Cock Video X 2B. If you mouse over the precision here, you can see the recommendation is to use FP16 on this model. But you can play with both and see what gives you the best results. For the sampler, I've had good results with both the Cock Video X DDIM and DPM. For this demo, I'll use DDIM. With the workload setup, submit this prompt. You'll see the steps moving along, but when it hits the model, it will freeze and start downloading the model in the background. You can check the download progress and time remaining in your prompt. When the model successfully downloads, it will move on to the next step into sampling. Again, when it hits the sampler, you can follow the progress and time remaining on this step in your prompt. The decode step will also take a bit of time and GPU to complete. But after that step, you should be presented with your first video created. And this is a really not bad quality. Taking into account we are only using the 2 billion parameter model here. With the 2B model out of the way, let's load up the 5B model. Clear the workflow and start with the default example workflow again. The 5B model is resource intensive. You'll need enough VRAM and RAM to use this model. You can submit the default prompt and test to see if you can get your first video created. Personally, I've been able to produce videos consistently by turning on sequential CPU offload and in the scheduler enabling VAE tiling. Let's submit the prompt using this selection. If you don't have the 5B model downloaded, it will follow the same process as the 2B model. It will download it for you. But this run will take much longer to complete the download and run through all the steps in the process. There you have it, a high quality rendition of our retriever with sunglasses. You can immediately see the difference. This is much better quality coming out of the 5B model. Let's full screen this. You should now have Cock Video X working on your PC. But let me share a couple of lessons learned before I sign off. If your models fail to download the first time automatically and you want to use the auto download procedure, Go to your project folder and into this models folder. Find the affected model and delete it completely. Then resubmit your prompt and that will kick off the download for you again. If you have any issues with your models, you can verify your files and folder sizes against the 2B and 5B model shown here on the screen. Also, Make sure you're always using the latest version of both the wrapper and Comfy UI. Check for updates often. Load these updates and run it again until you are presented with this screen that shows you there's no more updates available for your system. And remember that when you update the wrapper, visit the GitHub page again and find the latest example file, as there's changes that reflects the latest versions. And that's about it. You should now be up and running with Cock Video X. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, remember to give it a thumbs up and leave a comment. And remember, subscribe to our channel to stay abreast with our latest AI and technology videos.